Hey everyone, Lisa Gargetz here. Um, I had actually intended to create this video for you today to kind of show you around the outside of my house because November can be a really beautiful time up here in northern Wisconsin. Um, nature had some other ideas though and um, actually I'm going to show it to you. Let's uh, hold on one second while I undo my camera. And I'm going to show you, actually, um, <laughs> what we woke up to this morning. If you look out there, that's my driveway. Um, we didn't actually wake up to it shoveled. <laughs> my husband, God love him, is out there somewhere, and uh, he is shoveling everything. You can kind of see... It's very white and snowy. Um, let me show you. Kind of, we'll go this way. This is my, uh, this is our den. And it's up on the upper level of our little cabin in the woods here. Um, you can see there's our lake. And you can see all the snow. So, yeah, nature had other plans. I was actually going to take you on a little bit of a tour, um, but it's below 20 degrees out, so I'm frankly not going anywhere. So, um, get this. There we go. Um, a lot of people ask me how I got to be where I'm at in internet marketing, and I normally don't um, use notes in my videos, but I have so much to say with this video, and it is so serious and so important. I didn't want to leave anything out. So first, let me just give you the quick rundown. I started in internet marketing in March of 2009. By, let's see, I think it was, what, December 2009, right around nine months later, I came out with my very first info product. and that kind of was a light going on to me because I realized that you could do things one time, make, create something one time, and then make money with them over and over again. Um, so that was a kind of a really cool realization there for both myself and my husband who supports me in everything that I do, and I'm very lucky for that. Uh, now, fast forward a few months later in May of 2010, so about a year and two months or so, from when I initially discovered internet marketing, um, I was able to quit my full-time job in downtown Chicago where I worked and begin uh, doing internet marketing full-time. Now, that is an accomplishment. It's a huge accomplishment. And, uh, and I'm very proud of it. But what you also need to know is that I have always been the sole breadwinner for our family. Um, when my firstborn was very young, about five months old, we decided that my husband would stay home and be the stay-at-home parent, and I would go to work. It just worked for us. So we did that. And so when I say that I quit my job, I was making $55,000 a year working downtown Chicago. I was an administrative assistant in a commercial mortgage company. So uh, quitting my job was a huge leap of faith for not only me, but my entire family. We lost our benefits for a while, of course, and that's just, you know, part of, of what happens. And um, so fast forward another couple months, we decided that if we could live anywhere we wanted to, it, it wasn't going to be Chicago. And so we left. Um, August 2010, we left Chicago with $1,200 in our pocket. We didn't have the, you know, everybody says, you know, you, you should save up six months before you quit your job if you're going to start working for yourself. And yeah, that's, that's extremely good advice. But we wanted this badly enough that we decided uh, we were just going to do it. And we would let the cards fall, you know, where they may. So between March of 2009 and August of 2010, there was only that space before I completely, 
took my life on a 360. Um, and you just saw, you know, I just showed you a little bit about of where we live. It's it's very different than <laughs> living in Chicago, and you have to really be prepared for a lot of different things. And and the snowstorm kind of um, caught us off guard a little bit. So, anyways, I just wanted to kind of uh, give you a little bit of an overview before I get into the the true reason for my uh, my video here. Now, there there were a lot of people when I decided to quit my job, uh, and when we decided to move that said, oh my God, you can't, you have a family, you support your family, you can't possibly quit your job. And, okay, and then they said, you know, well, you can't, you can't move out to Nowheresville in the middle of, you know, Wisconsin where there's nothing, and, you know, what are your kids going to do, and, and blah, blah, blah. And it was then that I had a very interesting change of mindset. And... Instead of listening to all the, you know, you can't and, and telling myself I could never, I started asking myself, why couldn't I? Um, you know, um, let's, why couldn't I quit my job? Why couldn't I work for myself? And over the next couple of days, over the weekend, uh, or you know, during the week, because I'm not sure when I'm going to send this out yet, I want you to do some soul searching. And instead of saying, I could never, I could never quit my job, I want you to start asking yourself, why couldn't I? Why couldn't I move? Why couldn't I work for myself? Why couldn't I be financially comfortable without leaving the house, without going anywhere, you know? Now, I want you to understand something, and that is that when I say that I was miserable at my job, downtown Chicago, I had a great job, and I worked with relatively good people um, as far as large corporations go. The people were, were, were pretty good people. I hated my job because I hated leaving my family every day. Um, some of the physical symptoms that I went through as, as I started to become more and more unhappy were I would have uh, severe migraines. At one point I actually went to the emergency room because I thought I was having an embolism, a, a, a blood pocket in the brain. Um, but it was migraines, and I would have panic attacks on Sunday night when I knew I had to go to work on Monday. There were many, many days that as I left and I kissed my family goodbye in the morning, um, I would cry on my way to the train station. I hated it that much. And so when I discovered internet marketing and started having these aha moments, I realized that this was a way out of the nine to five grind. And this was a way that I could realistically live that dream that so many of us have of being with my family, raising my family. So I just wanted to let you know that when I say, yeah, I didn't like my job, it wasn't like, well, you know, it was an okay job. It was killing me. It was making me physically sick. And I think that a lot of times we tie ourselves down to the very things that we hate. And we do it, I think, mostly for, because of um, societal pressures. People tell you, you know, you must own a home. You must have a good job. You must go to college. Those things are really, excuse my language, kind of bullshit, aren't they? I mean, I, well, now I know they are. <laughs> because I looked the other way and I finally said, I'm not doing what everyone else wants me to do anymore. I'm going to do what my family 
needs me to do. I'm going to do what I need me to do. And it's a huge, huge change of mindset to, to go from going along with what society thinks that you should do to, um, to doing what you need to do for yourself, you know? Now, the point of this video is that I am going to be um, opening up 15 positions for one-on-one -on -one mentoring with me. In this video, I'm not going to get into what all it's going to entail other than to say it will cover in depth the, um, well, the, the Amazon Mini Sites model, creating and selling those. But it is also going to delve heavily into product creation and, <clears throat> excuse me, I got a little bit emotional back there. <laughs> um, I apologize. It's also going to deal with a, 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 a huge amount of product creation and list building because you cannot, you cannot just run a business on, you know, creating and selling websites. You have to, you have to diversify. But that's subject for a whole other video. Um, but what I, what I want to let you know is I am opening up 15 slots, and it's not going to be a, um, it's not going to be something where I put out a buy link and, and everybody can buy, because with the amount of time that I'm going to devote to each of these 15 people, I don't want to work with just anybody. And at this point in my career, I don't have to do this for financial reasons, so I'm going to be very, uh, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to kind of pick the people who approach me that I want to work with because uh, it's, no, it's, it's, it's no fun to do it otherwise and I quit my job so I could have fun. So, <laughs> you know, that's why I do this. So I just want to let you know that, um, that I'm, I am doing that and if, if you are ready to go from the, from the mentality, my pug is snoring behind me wake up because she can get pretty loud. If you're ready to go from the mentality of I couldn't to asking yourself why couldn't I? Then I really want to work with you. Um, if you are at a point where you are ready to accept a helping hand, maybe you realize that that's something that you really need and you are willing to take some very decisive action so that maybe next year this time, maybe sooner, you could kick your job to the curb. I want that for you, and I want to work with you. Um, if you are very, very tired of hearing all your internet marketing friends on Facebook or whatever telling stories about how easy it is and you just maybe you have all the pieces you have all the skill sets but you just can't seem to put it all together and make it work then I want to work with you I really really do because I've done all this I know the shortcuts to take and I know the places where you can't take shortcuts. If you are truly ready to put in some hard work and feel great that you're going to be rewarded with a stronger bottom line, a happier self, and more freedom in your life, then really not only do I want to work with you, but you need to work with me. And, you know, I've just shown you around just a very little bit. And if it weren't for the snowstorm, I would have shown you around a lot more. But, you know, this is not for everybody. I know that. I grew up up here. So, um, so this is all kind of like just coming home to me, you know, to get 8 or 12 inches of snow at a time, it, you know, overnight or whatever. Yeah, eh, 
it just happens up here. I know that this kind of lifestyle isn't for everybody, and that's okay. You know, I wouldn't want it to be for everybody. But if you are at a place in your life where, like me, you are so miserable that it's causing you physical symptoms, uh, or, or you just can't seem to pull your shit together enough to make this internet marketing thing work for you, then I want to work with you. And um, so email me if you're interested. We'll, we'll have a chat. We'll talk. Um, and uh, thanks for taking the time to watch this video. I really, really appreciate it. And uh, hopefully I'll be talking to you soon. And hopefully I'll be working with you soon.